Hey there, Zags. Greg Talbot here for the final day of Destination Provo here on GUTV. We have the beautiful Wasatch Mountain Range in our background, and at the foot of the mountain, the campus of BYU, where the Zags, of course, won last night to win the West Coast Conference, and where we spent the morning this morning taking a look at their broadcasting program. This is the award-winning 11 News at Noon. They're good at what they do. Fantastic, actually. When it's crunch time in the KBYU newsroom, it's no joke because a million people can see that day's broadcast. Okay, everybody, three minutes to deadline. Uno, dos, tres, let's do this. Come in here in as, as real world a situation as we can create and practice. Show that you can do it. BYU's undergrad broadcast program is one of the most admired in the country, and for good reason. Their daily broadcasts are carried across the entire state, and they have a legitimate audience at home. When that light comes on on that camera, it's not just going into a tape machine somewhere so that we can analyze it later. Any home in our entire state that wishes to turn it on at that moment could see this newscast. And that, that gives a little different vibe to it. And as great as the professional broadcast training is, the students say it's the integration of personal development that sets their program apart. Well, we have the honor code. Um, we, we all get along. We all have the same standards. We don't compromise our standards to get stories, to um, go out and get information. So I think having a standard that no one is going to drop below helps us to produce good news stories. Seeking out that which is good and which is right, in addition to covering what needs to be fixed, uh, is important if you're going to be a journalist approaching it from a faith-based platform. Gonzaga, we found out literally and that might just be the biggest thing that we and our new friends at KBYU have in common.